welcome back to my channel or hi if you're new here my name is Emma I make videos I post every Sunday at 8 o'clock so if you're not subscribed to my channel you should go down below and do that right now also my Instagram name is in the description box below if you want to go check that out one of my favorite videos to watch on YouTube are favorites videos, so I thought I would do one myself and do my summer favorites. So let's just hop right into it. So I'm going to start with one of the things that I've been really liking this summer, and that is Blaze Pizza. If you don't know what Blaze Pizza is, basically it's this pizza place where you go down the line with your pizza, kind of like Subway except it's pizza, and you personalize your pizza the way that you want it, and then they fire it up in one of those um, wood fire grill thing, oven, wood fire oven, wood fire oven fire oven you know what I mean I'll put the word here which what I'm trying to say but they put it up in one of those and then they bring it out to you and it's amazing and the big thing that I really like about it is that it's gluten-free but I'm getting off topic I have been eating that pizza so much more than I should like in the last two weeks I think I've probably eaten it three or four times and that's not good at all that's not healthy I know that but I've just been completely obsessed with it recently and I thought I would share that with you because if you haven't been there I definitely suggest that you go try it out, but try not to get addicted to it like me. Now the next thing, I actually just had it for the first time today, but I thought that I would include it into my, my food and beverage type uh, favorite things. It's the Starbucks Dragon Fruit Refresher. But it's delicious. It's like so, well of course it's refreshing, I'm the, it's called a refresher. Honestly, it's so refreshing. It tastes like sort of like a tea mixed with lemonade kind of deal. And it's pink, so that's pretty. But it tastes really good, and if you haven't tried it, then I suggest that you go try it, because it's a great summer beverage, and I think that it's limited time, so you should go try it while they still have it. And no, I'm not a spokesperson for either of these places. I just really wanted to share that with you. So the next thing that I've really been enjoying this summer is going thrift store shopping, but that's not it. It's these amazing mom shorts I bought. So I bought these at Goodwill, uh, like, the other day, and I've been wearing them nonstop. They're the cutest things I've ever seen. They're just so flattering on my body, which is kind of weird because I guess they're like kind of ugly in a way, but ugly in a cute way, if you know what I mean. Yeah, but <laughs> I've been wearing them nonstop since I bought them, and I just think they are the trendiest, cutest, most comfortable pants I've ever owned. If you've never tried on a pair of mom shorts or mom jeans, then you need to go try it on because it takes away so much of the stress of like sitting down and having your pants slide down and having to pull them back up as soon as you stand up. It takes away all that stress, and they are just so comfortable and so cute. The next thing I'm wearing right now, just go ahead and take these off, are these adorable black shoes that I bought from Target the other day. So I have a pair of black shoes that are very similar to this, but I really liked these because they were plushier. They have like a texture to them. I'll do a close up right here so that you can see. They've just got this crisscross pattern and they're black and they're kind of plushy. So I just think that that's really cute because my old ones, well, the ones I, I have two pairs. So the other ones are stretchier and not so much like plushy, you know, and they're not like stable like these. I don't know, these just felt more like, <laughs> I guess able to do more stuff. The other ones kind of felt like loungier ones, I guess. And they were kind of getting dingy because I wore those nonstop when I bought them. So now I have two pairs of very similar shoes so that I can go back and forth between the two and I won't get them as dirty. I should put these back on. The next thing I've really been loving, sounds really vain when I say it out loud, but it is my Instagram theme. Just look at it. I've never had an Instagram theme that has looked that pretty in a very, very long time. Now granted, I'm saying this out loud, so it'll probably be destroyed in the next couple weeks, but it's pretty right now while it lasts. So if you haven't seen it, I, go look at it. I'm very proud of it. Um, but yeah, I just, I wanted to share that with you because it's a special thing for me to have a cute Instagram that cute right now. I don't know what my collar's doing. It's like, I'll just like flip it this way. Yeah, that'll work. The next thing I've been loving this summer are these pins. It sounds weird to be talking about pins and school supply type things, while I'm on summer break, but I've actually been using these a lot. I got these right before school and did last year, well, not last year, but like a couple months ago, you know, junior year, summer, senior year, last year. So at the end of my junior year, I bought these and I've been obsessed with them. But the reason that I've been using them so much is because I've been studying for the ACT, which I have to take, oh my gosh, on Saturday. So when you'll be seeing this video, I would have taken it yesterday. Whoa. Anyway, so I've been using these to practice for the ACT. Now in the ACT, you can't actually use uh, pins or colored markers of any sort, but it really helps me study. So when I go to tutoring and things like that, I just take these with me and they're so helpful because they're erasable and 
if you know me then you know I have a weird thing about pencils in which I hate them so I use pens all the time but the big thing about that is that I can't spell worth anything so when I've been writing I scribble it out and it makes a mess so for studying these are really great to have so that I can just erase them or whatever I got them from Target by the way moving into more beauty type things I got this the other day when it came out if you don't know what it is it's the Zoella body mist from her new Splash Botanics collection mm, it smells so good it's the most refreshing like tr not tropical re but refreshing fresh outdoorsy beautiful smell i've ever smelled before i'm not just saying this because i love zoella but i love zoella too but her stuff is amazing this new collection i smelled a lot of the stuff at the store and then i bought this the day that it came out in the united states which might have been the same day as the uk i don't really know but oh my gosh it smells so good and i've been wearing it every day and it's a great summer scent so if you haven't gone so if you haven't smelled this, then I think you should go to the store and smell it because... Mm. The next beauty thing and the last thing that I have to share with you today is this. I got this beautiful, beautiful highlighting thingy thing. Highlighting, what do you call this? Palette. Highlight and contour palette. I got it from Target. It was only like $7 or something. I think I even used the red card on it, so I think I probably got a couple dollars off even more. But... Okay, so let me just talk about it. Look at these beautiful colors. They've got pink, they've got gold, bronzies, and browns. And it's so pretty. And the best thing about this is that it smells amazing, which sounds really weird, but it's like a, it's like a chocolatey deliciousness. It's sweet and it's really good. And if you know me, then you probably know that I don't wear highlighter that often, but since I bought this, I've been wearing highlight every day. Maybe it makes me look like I'm sweaty and I'm just oblivious, but I think that it looks really pretty and it's nice. So that will be it for this video. If you liked it, then please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if these are any of your summer favorites or what yours are. I wanna know, I like talking to you guys. And I will see you guys next Sunday at eight o'clock. Bye. <laughs>